to bring up the emoji keyboard, you're going to place your cursor in the text field where you'd like to add an emoji. Hit Command, Control, Space. And you should see the keyboard pop up and appear on screen. When you've found the emoji you want to use, just click on it and it inserts into the field where you placed your cursor. To take screenshots using the snipping tool, you can capture a specific area by hitting Command Shift 4. And you'll get a crosshair that you can drag with your mouse to capture the area you want. To capture an entire window, hit Command Shift 4 again. Hit the space bar. Now you can click on any window you want and take a shot of that entire window, shadow included. To capture the entire desktop, hit Command Shift 3. It automatically captures the entire desktop. To use Spotlight as a calculator, hit Command plus Space. Type your equation, for example, 1 plus 1. And the answer will immediately appear. In order to sign PDFs digitally, you're going to first open the Preview app on your Mac. Click on the document you want to sign, hit open. If the markup tool isn't showing, click the show markup tool bar button. Click the sign button and click here to begin. Draw your signature. and hit enter when you're finished. Click done. And you've created your signature using the trackpad. When you want to use it, just click on it. Drag it to where you need to be. You can change the size of it if need be. And there you have it. To use your computer's built-in camera, you're going to write your signature on a white piece of paper, click the signature icon again, click create signature, click camera this time. Hold your signed paper in front of the camera so that the signature is level with the blue line in the window. When you're done, click done and click the signature to add it to the PDF. Again, you can adjust the size by dragging the corners. To rename files in bulk, you want to highlight the files you want to rename. Hit the drop down button with the gear. Hit rename in the number of items. Make sure you're in format. 
and it should be name and index format where after name and custom format field type in what you would like to name the files leave this starts number at one and hit rename This is a Ryan Little production.